you look at last year, we were in a position to win the league. We lost game 10. We got a home game in the playoffs. We lost a home game in the playoffs. Uh, we don't we don't like losing at Stewart Field. And so we, we did not end the way we wanted to end. We just have to do the little things. And I mean, Coach McQuaid preaches that all the time. The little things are what, are what wins you games. I think every position on our offense has guys who either started or played last year. And then we have guys, we have some guys back on the defense, but just have less experience. And we have guys, don't get me wrong, they just haven't played yet. And they're still working, we're all still working, and we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. You have Khalil back at running back, you have Grant McCurry back, you have Dom back, you have some guys at front back. What do you like about this offense? We have a ton of speed. All our guys are, uh, almost every guy we have runs track. All our receivers. So, I mean, it's just, it really falls on me to get them the ball. They're really good players and they're really hard to bring down. So, if we can get them the ball in space, we can be really good. I feel like our skill players have a lot of speed and we're definitely going to use that this season. How's Pat come along as a quarterback? Oh, Pat, I see like a big difference every year. Like, he always getting better and I, I love that about him. He started as a freshman, now he's a junior, and he's just getting better and better. I like our speed uh, on the outsides. We have really good receivers, really good skills. Pat, Ike, Greg, Grant, Dom, Ethan Wong. We got a lot of skill guys, so we just have to translate that up front to be able to put them into in the position where they can use their their skills to make big plays. We got Najee back. It's great to have Najee. Um, it's good. It's great to go up against him in practice every day. It helps everyone uh, compete and improve every day in practice. He gets off the ball really quick, and it's it's tough sometimes, especially if you're in pass set. He'll just be on you before you even expect it. It's great to see Najee back. He's a huge part of our defense. Uh, big guy, so you know he gets to the quarterback quick. Um, it's just great having him back. The way he recovered, he recovered very well. Uh, he came back faster than I thought, and I, I love that. So I'm looking forward to the season, what he does. Still getting back, still um, getting used to things, but I say I'm looking pretty good. Biggest challenge is just like getting used to the game speed, I think, because just still getting my quickness up, just getting used to it all. You guys had a ton of BLTs last year, especially from your defensive front. Mm -hmm. What's going to be a challenge with replacing some of those guys that graduated? Uh, it's going to be hard. We, they had some, we had some really nice guys last year, but I feel like our defensive line is going to be good. We're, we're pretty big, pretty strong. We have guys that have experience like Dylan Shelton, Tommy Lucarelli. Like they were on the line rotating last year. Then we have Jack coming in who's fast off the line. I say we're looking pretty good. I think we have more guys that played last year than people think we do, um, but that doesn't mean anything. Last year is, is, is over. This team, we have experience at at each position, you know, the, the backfield, the quarterback, the receiver up front. So we have, we might not have as many guys returning, but we have guys at each of those those position groups that have played before. And it's the same thing though. Um, if we're just talking about what we did last year, mm -hmm. our, our experience last year, Hudson doesn't care about that. Twinsburg, mm -hmm. Stowe, Manor, everybody we play. It's what, we, what we're doing now to, to improve upon that.